Morning everybody, as you can see outside, it's still chucking it down, so no golf today. It's now Tuesday when I'm filming this uh, in preparation for Pin High going out on Thursday. There hasn't been any golf on Monday and Tuesday because the uh, work that's been going on on the course, but just to let you know, in spite of the pouring rain, the team's been out there doing all the verti draining that they were planning to do anyway. So big thanks to the Greens team for going out when most of us would be inside keeping warm and dry. Uh, so the green staff have been out there doing the jobs that they were going to do. So thanks very much to Ollie and the team. Um, I, in the respite of the rain, I did, we did manage to play a captain and pro on Sunday. Um, Adam and I played against Whiskey and James Miller. Uh, and if I tell you that there were 14 birdies in that match, of which I got precisely zero, but Adam got eight birdies in his round, including six in the first nine. Bottom line though, sadly, uh, we lost on the last hole, which made me realize that I was elected as men's captain for other attributes rather than my golfing prowess, because I'm afraid I didn't really help Adam on a day when he was playing like an absolute god, but he, he has forgiven me, but he was just off the scale when it came to his putting. Um, so I also played on Friday and I had a guest here who was a member at Tandridge um, and he was absolutely bowled over by the quality of the greens here. So we were back on main greens on Friday. Um, so we had a lovely round with uh, him and another guest. Uh, and as I said, he was absolutely, he said in, in, compared with Tandridge, our greens are far superior. So everything that the team's doing is absolutely paying dividends. We are, of course, looking to hopefully get some decent golf in once the weather improves. Uh, the weather, every time it rains, the course gets more waterlogged. So we, even when I played on Sunday, it's, we started off and the ground was absolutely fine. Within three hours of just gentle drizzle, it was waterlogged, slippery, so much so that I fell over. Um, so just please be aware, aware that just a little bit of rain because the water table so high is gonna make the course pretty much unplayable. So please, please respect the decision that the Greens team make if and when they have to close the course. Um, so um, knockouts are gonna be drawn very soon as I, as I mentioned recently. So hopefully we'll then be able to all sign up for some matches and the weather will improve and we'll get some golf in. And we've got the scramble coming up, we've got the Bandits driver coming up, uh, we've got um, the Robbie Robson Rose, Rose Bowl coming up over the next few Sundays. So we really, really, really hope that we're gonna have some decent weather. Um, and just to, uh, something about the knockouts, we've decided we're not gonna try and have a finals day. We've tried, tried that in the past where we have a day where all the knockout finals get played, but really that's not practical. Uh, so, but what we are going to do, we're going to have a presentation evening in October, and this is going to be, it's going to coincide with the men's AGM. And just to clarify that, you may or may not remember that I did a video, what, six months or so ago, about the new club constitution with the club council replacing the captain's committee. And as a result of that, the layabouts already have an AGM at which they appoint their captain and vice captain as do the ladies. So the men's section will have a separate AGM at the beginning of October. It's probably going to be October the 10th, but we'll confirm that. And at that AGM, we will elect the men's committee, the men's captain, the men's vice captain, obviously all based on the recommendations that come down from the past captains. But we will also do all the presentations that evening of all the men's competitions throughout the summer. So it should be a great evening. It'll be a Thursday night. So Thursday, 10th of April, put it in your diary. We will confirm that. So that's enough from me. As you can see, I'm booted and suited and I'm on my way up to town. No, way of, no chance of playing golf today anyway. Uh, but I very much look forward to speaking to you next week. Cheers.